Hi, good day. This is Ken Lau. Today we're going to talk about something on day 360. So what is this about? Right, let's see the definitions. Day 360 returns the numbers of day between two dates. Okay, it's between two dates. But it's based on the 360 day. Well, what does it mean? 12 30 day months. Now each month is considered 30 days. Although some months in the normal calendars it will be 31 days. But in these functions it treats 31 days as 30 days. So it returns the number of days between two days. Let's see an example. So now usually 31 to 1, 1 of February is, con is, is considered one day. That's okay. Now how about if I turn this into 3-0. Now 3-0 January 30, 30 of January to 1st of February is considered, now first of all this is one day, after that the second day. But in days 360, it will still give you one day difference. Now that's because when you consider January, it only counts until 30 of January. It considered a 30 days. Each month has only 30 days. Now let's see what happens to you. So that is days 360. Right, let's see as a, an, a, another example. Right, right here. Now 29 to 31st, right, 29 to 31st is considered two days. It's all because it is between the same month and the starting date is earlier than the end dates. And the end dates happens to be on the last days of the, of the month itself. Right, again, 29 to 30, one day, 29 to 31st, two days. Thank you for watching. This is Ken Lau.